a shade after three. The tide is low in about an hour. Gray Matter City. Mumbles man's got the flu. I mean a cold or something. Sore throat. Scratchy throat. Guru uh, might be out somewhere. Him and Gary hunted the bay yesterday somewhere down near Willoughby and found about 30 to 35 pieces of gray matter each and only about 75 cents a change. But they said it was so much gray matter there that all they had to really do was walk along with the scoop and scoop it up. It was laying right on top of the sand. I have no clue what we'll find here today. But it's a nice day, beautiful just like it was yesterday. I'm going down there towards that bridge construction. <laughs> See how it goes. Stand by. Well, the first target. A solid 12.30 at 9 inches. Stand by. Whatever it was, was one scoop deep. Looks like a cruddy penny. I mean cruddy too, buddy. Nice. Nice. Well, just what I was looking for. Now we got a solid 1216, 1217. I don't like the way it sounds now. I'm thinking bottle cap. We have a find it again. Yeah, that's what it is. A piece of junk, I bet you. Yeah, there it is right there. This is what I thought it was, a bottle cap. Crushed up a little bit. You turkey. Well, there's the first piece, four ounces, gray matter. You get a choppy signal with these because you get the lead, then you get that stainless steel eye in them. Some of them got brass eyes. You get a different reading for that. There it is, four ounces of gray matter. Ooh, look at that hole. It was deep too, buddy. Well, we dug a penny, a, a, a grommet, and five or six pieces of gray matter. Here we got a 1205. Stand by a minute. 12.05, okay. Fine bottle, piece of an old bottle cap. You no good turkey, you. Man, I got excited for a minute. This is the new bridge. That's the thing right there that puts the road bed in. You see that road bed right there behind it? Well, somehow they fabricate all that over on the right hand side where you can't see. And they get it over here to that big yellow thing and it lays it in place. It's going to be a nice bridge. They're going to build another one just like it alongside it. Once they get this one operational, they're going to tear the other bridge down and build a new one. Two new ones. But they got some giant cranes in here, I can tell you that. The clean contracting is doing all this bridge work. It's a local outfit. Well, not local, but they have a local office here. The afternoon rockfish boats are flying in, trying to beat in the darkness. I don't know if they caught any rock, but there's a lot of boats coming in. Stand by. In all, all the years I hunted here, I never found one of these till today. A eagle button. <laughs> I guess this is going to be a year for eagles, 2000. I mean, year for buttons. I don't think it's very old, but 
but I can't really see it that good. I can just see an eagle. Got a nice looking back on it. I like the back part fine. We'll get it cleaned up when we get home a little bit. I'm hoping these guys might catch a fish. So far, I haven't seen anything. Lures only. A Lund, that's a nice aluminum boat right there. If you like aluminum boats, L U N D. That's almost as good as mine lab. They're a bit pricey, but they're really nice. I don't know how they do in the salt water, but I know for the fresh water, buddy, that's a taquito right there. Okay, I guess we gotta head back. It's getting dark. There's a fine looking taquito right there coming in. You don't see many gray boats like that. <laughs> well here's the line I work coming down. I drug my scoop a long way so I could, you know, tell where I was. I'm going to follow that back, but I'm going to alternate from side to side about six feet or seven feet each way. See if there's anything above or above. Everything I found was right in that line right now. Hope coming down here. Stand by. I'm going to give him all my gray matter. I don't feel like lugging it back. Not that I got a lot, but I'm just going to give it to him to keep the button. Gray matter. I gave him one earlier when I went by. Yeah, the other one, this one. Oh, yeah, big fat one I gave him. <laughs> okay. I got something shiny here, but it's dark. I can't see much. But the color's right. It's too little to be anything. I think it's just some kind of bling or something. It's all sanded up. Well, it's roundup time. That uh, little round blingy thing was an earring. Mm -hmm. Like a stud. You can see it right there. I don't know what the hell that's supposed to be, but... And the button cleaned up really nice, consider it. I don't think it's very old. I think it's a modern day button. It's got something I can't make out. It says some kind of company on it. That's about it. Stand by. Uh, maybe I'll see you tomorrow. I don't think so. I got a big knife gig tomorrow at some culinary school in Newport News. Maybe Culinary Institute of Virginia or something like that. I don't know what it is. Got to be over there in the evening. Five o'clock, I think. Stand by.